thanks for coming. My name is Dolores Steinhauser. I uh, was a Wingard and my parents started Wingard's Nursery. My dad's here today and uh, one of our employees, Dale Miller, they're going to be giving you um, the lowdown on how to grow some good vegetables. When I was growing up in Lexington, everybody had a garden. Uh, and most people lived on a number of acres of land and they all had a tractor and they all plowed fields like this one over here with their tractor and we all had vegetables all summer long and we canned them and as children we shucked corn and we shelled peas and we scraped beans and I absolutely hated every minute of it <laughs> except the tractor riding part I really liked that part my dad's been doing it all his life he plant, he still plants you'll see rows of corn out here and okra and uh, he puts tomatoes around the nursery and pots so they'll get irrigated by our sprinkler system and so uh, there's a generation of people in this area that grew up gardening they know how to garden they can grow wonderful beautiful bushels and baskets of all kinds of vegetables and it's really time that we need to, to pass that information along I asked Dale to help my dad with the seminar because Dale moved here from Indiana. So first of all, he's not a native Midlands gardener, and a lot of our customers are from the north or the Midwest, and they're not native to this area. So he can help share some what he learned when he came here. Also, Dale gardens on a very small backyard um, in, in raised beds, so it's a different type of gardening than plowing a field with a tractor. So you're going to get to hear uh, two sides of the story, two different versions of how to garden, and somehow come up with, uh, with what works for you in the middle. And so I'm really delighted to have you. I'm delighted to have both Dale and my dad Judson here uh, to share with you. And so I'll just turn it over to them. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Dolores. What uh, I hope to do the first half hour is to basically cover the outline on your first two pages, uh, mostly talking about how to get your garden set up and get started primarily for first-time gardeners. During the second half hour, I'd like to open it for questions and, and, and uh, primarily for, for Mr. Wingard to be able to give you uh, uh, lessons from his own experience in terms of vegetables that he's grown that maybe you would like to grow or that you've already tried to grow and uh, maybe had some problems with. So uh, between the two of us, I think we'll both admit that although we've both been gardening most of our lives, or all of our lives, uh, he much longer than me, we're still learning. Uh, he tells me some things I never heard of, and I've, I think I've told him a few things that he not only never heard of, but probably didn't believe either. But um, <laughs> on the internet, you can come up with all kinds of interesting things, but I, I much prefer to hear from someone who's not only heard about it, but who's actually tried it and maybe not try three things at once on the same plant and then not know which one actually worked but somebody that kind of sets up a little test and sets up a little test and is able to uh, tell you from their own experience uh, what actually works. 